Rikiev has two bulls. Target, uh, you can say goodbye to Target. What is the difference? Uh, I don't think there's no difference. It's just I fancy the change, and I've got new darts, new equipment, new people around uh, in my side now. It's yeah, it's uh, it's nice to have. Well, I've got new darts now, and it's equipment, and yeah, I'm, pl I'm playing very well with them. It, in the last years of Target, you're dropping a little bit on the ranking, but is the plan to the Bulls you growing up and up and up? Of course, of course, yeah. It's uh, Target wasn't the reason I was dropping, it was just I weren't getting results. And uh, well now I'm just focused on getting back up there where I belong, because I I I should be top I should be top 16, top 10. I've got the game, it's just doing it now with the problem. You're standing out, outside of the, of the World Championship now. What can you do the difference on the next, uh, next tournaments to go on that list for the World Championships? Just to hit the doubles, I guess, because <laughs> uh, this year I've played really well. It's probably the best year I've played, stats-wise and averages-wise, but as anyone will tell you, averages mean nothing. It's when getting the W, win, win games. I'd rather I'd rather win games with 82 averages than what I'm doing. I'm losing with 95, 96, 97. So uh, just keep, I'm not doing anything wrong. I just, you just gotta, you just gotta believe in yourself, because I, I, I believe, I believe I can win. And I, st I still go into every tournament thinking I can win, and I, one day it will happen. So, is a reason is that the levels going up and up and up are the competing players. In the first round, you have to hit uh, over the hundred average, and then you win. Is that the, is that the problem now? I wouldn't say it's a problem. It's just it's just the beauty of darts, I guess. It's everyone's good. Everyone they, they all dedicate their game and uh, their life to the darts, and you've just got to yeah take the wins because I'm I'm more than capable of doing it like you said the first the first game's the problem if I can get past the first game I'm very happy but yeah I'll, I'll keep going I'll be alright I'll be alright I'm alright we're standing in the Netherlands and not for an exhibition did I, this time but for a tournament do you like it? it's very good It's uh, I don't like the heat as you can tell I've got my towel but uh, yeah it's, uh, it's, it's, it's it's a good thing that what they're doing here it's a good setup good players good standard so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying myself. Yeah. It's the first time you're doing something outside of your of the UK that you come to play a tournament in the Netherlands, a small local tournament with what top players? No, I've done a few like in Ireland, Germany. Like a, it's more like a put a show on. Then this is this is serious. So it's like uh, next week and we have the pro do, pro tour in Germany, and it's it'll be, it'll be nice to go there like with this title. It'd be nice to go like to Kim, Ian White, Steve Beaton. I won. I won last week. I won. That was me in Holland. But yeah, it's a bit of pride. It's it's good dance as well. It's good practice. Yeah. The preparation for that tournament, you need it tournament very very well for the World Championship spot. Is this is this the thing some players need more to do? Maybe. Yeah. I, I don't. I don't think you can never have too much darts in my opinion. I, I play. I still play pubs, my my local leagues, my local counties. So yeah, I, I don't think as you can ever play too much. So yeah, why why not? Why not do this every week? <laughs> it, it would be good for me. I'd take that. Ricky Evans, thank you. No problem. Thank you. Thank you.